because not only Peach lives a really long time on that stage, but also kind of falls to the like the keep away fox. Yeah, yeah. But Mouth has been a player who's uh, not been afraid to take other foxes there. Like a little bit more comfortable in his rushdown. He is a very aggressive, yeah. like forward pushing player. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Mouth used to be very, very uh, salty about campy the, the campy foxes. Mm -hmm. Uh, but he, he actually took some time and played a bunch of Fox and said he was going to become a Fox main and then said, wait, no, I figured something out. I'm not going to be a Fox main. I'm going to stick with Peach. <laughs> yeah, that is definitely one thing. Like, actually playing as the player, uh, as the character that you're playing against, you can definitely see, get a better feel for, like, yeah. what it is that they do, where the holes are in their gameplay. Yeah. It's, I think it's really important to, uh, when you're having difficulty in a matchup, to learn how to play that other character for the matchup. So... For instance, I play Falcon. If I've been having difficulty with Falco lately, I'm going to learn how to play Falco, and I'm going to do the thing to other Falcons, what Falcos do to me that I have a difficult time with, and see how they deal with it. Um, I think that's a good idea, and I think that's what Mouth did. Uh, and he figured out how to deal with them campy foxes. Pretty sure his answer was, like, pull turnips. Pulling turnips pretty good option, yeah. yeah. Oh, um, no, good read on the roll, but doesn't actually get the grab bubble. Yeah, he waved a little bit too far in. Very nice controller, though. Actually putting that just uh, early enough that it would beat out the approaching Fox controller. Not an easy thing to do. Nice. Ooh, uh, yeah, she'll drop there. Oh, it's so Ooh. much damage. Oh, Jabber said that was sick. 77 damage from that conversion. I think oh, he might even take it to the bank. Oh, oh I think, did he maybe miss a bear there? Possibly, yeah. yeah. Ooh, okay. 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 Slapped okay. it. Dropped it. Ah, uh, the Wonder does manage to mop it up. Does have to be careful here, though. One stray hit from Peach is could be more than enough to finish the stock off. Yep, the up throw, neutral air will finish it. Mouth with the solid one stock lead. Good smash. Yeah, good SDI. Uh, it's, sometimes it's kind of difficult to tell if it was good SDI or if the fox just kind of messed up. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but that was that definitely was really good SDI. SDI. That was some yes. sick SDI. Malf, when you go back and watch this, I applaud you on that <laughs> SDI. It was fantastic. Yeah, whenever you're uh, you're straight up, yeah, box, it's pretty difficult to SDI out of the way. Yeah, and then when you like literally teleport a character link. Oh, oh that was hype. Uh, whenever you literally <laughs> teleport like the entire length of your character to the side, like you know that's some pretty sick, sick nasty SDI right mm. there. Oh, kind of a panic up B from Mouth trying to get out of the corner, but... Yeah, like we said earlier, up B is actually the best move in the game. That holds true for Peach, too. <laughs> I, I, it doesn't, actually. No, no, not, not at all. It is an out-of-shield option with Peach, question mark? Yeah, I mean, it's. I believe it is actually invulnerable, so it will, like, beat out attacks. But it's so slow afterwards that more, like, if you ever miss with it, it leaves you wide open yeah. for launch. Yeah, it's not like Samus where like she can like go to platforms or like potentially edge cancel or like move around in tricky ways. Well, you know, yeah. if you miss the beach up beat, you're gonna get back air by Fox. Wonder a bit of an opportunity now if he does manage to mop his stock up now that would be very beneficial for him, oh. but a little too late on the up, uh, up smash and then spacing a little too low. Yep, that's what's going on. Yep, yep. So looks like uh, game two. Oh, maximum tomato hype. And maximum tomato. Where do you think they're going to go? Uh, well, so, yeah, Fox, I think the best stage for this matchup is Pokemon Stadium. So naturally, Mouth is going Mouth to ban that. Yeah. And then it's a question of whether Ma whether Wonder wants to play the aggro game with Yoshi's story and, you know, and try to get kills early or go to Dreamland and try to play more defensive. Yeah. So looks like he is going to opt for Yoshi's story. Which is kind of a dangerous pick. Mouth is a pretty aggressive peach. That I actually really like the back there. Yeah. Whether or not it was intentional or <laughs> not, um, I've seen Dark Rain do this with Falcon as well, where he's in a situation where the back there will always put his opponent onto the platform. Uh -huh. And so he'll use that just to set up really, really good platform deck chases. Oh, that's cool. I Okay, that's yeah. awesome. Yeah, it really surprised me the first time Dark Rain did it, because I was like, wow, that, that had to be an accident. Like That was a really good, like, Adjustment afterwards, you accidentally back threw me, and then you yeah. got me afterwards. Like that was good. And then he did it a second time, and I was like, "You're doing that intentionally." <laughs> that, that's that's really smart. Yeah. Holy moly! Kind yeah. of a, a little curveball you can throw your opponent, but gonna keep it nice and simple there. No curveballs necessary. One speed throw right in the up throw up air. Uh, a side B from mouth. Uh, side B, not the best move in the game. Definitely not the best move in the game. Uh, 
fair. Fair is a really best good move. move in the game. <laughs> <laughs> no, but you no, know, Peach's fair is really good. It is extremely good. The fa uh, especially the, the you know the hitbox is huge. It hits really really hard. It does a lot of damage. The angle is very favorable for killing. Um, and of course, she has slow cancel. Exactly. So it is extremely good on shield. Yes, and that's why it's the best move in the game. Yes. Because there's like four frames of landing lag if you float cancel it. Yeah. 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 Peach actually, whenever she does uh, proper float cancel aerials on shield, is actually plus on shield. And Smash is not designed for characters <laughs> to actually be plus on yeah. shield. Like even Fox, like the reason why his shine pressure works is because shine comes out on frame one. It's not because his other attacks have like very, very yeah. uh, little landing. But they've got relatively low landing lag, but they're still negative. Yeah. Peach isn't. <laughs> players though at high percent. Well, if I'm going to want to be finishing this stock up as soon as possible, that back air will definitely do it. Those down airs from mouth, not a bad idea. Trying to intercept a back air coming in ahead of time, but wonder being patient, just waiting it out. So I think I think mouth might have been expecting a, a side B, and that's why he down aired. Um, but instead, wonder dropped down a little lower and up B. I don't know if that's actually what happened. That's just what it seemed like to me. Uh, regardless. Yeah, not getting caught by the down smash. I'm trying to fall up over the low cancel pressure from Mouth, but the landing leg is low enough that he was still able to put out attacks. One wonders on the way down. Ice falling up there, though. Counter hitting that down tilt, almost converting into a kill off of it. Oh, very good preemptive dash attack. Gonna beat out the neutral air setup. This is gonna be an opportunity. Good DI from Mouth, though, going off stage, knowing that Wonder doesn't have the space to get a running start. That, I feel like that was a little bit of a drop there. Uh, that side beat to stage uh, was one, a drop by Wonder. I'm pretty sure that was supposed to be a sweet spot. And two, Mouth just kind of stayed floating there in front of him. I think maybe, Mouth, don't get mad at me if I'm wrong about this, maybe he expected him to roll and was going to back air him or awesome. air him. That's my best guess. Maybe he thought he couldn't get there in time to punish it, and so he thought, okay, he's probably going to roll because he's going to expect me to try to punish it. Down tilt, finishing the stock though. Down tilt, notoriously good move. Actually, it is the best in the game. Um. Wonder starting to play the platform game, trying to play a little bit more safe. Wonder with the crouch cancel down smash. How do you like that, Peach? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Malfron is damage. sick. Uh, punish game against Fox. Malf has a, actually a fantastic punish game against uh, fast ballers. Um, I don't think it's really super possible to have a fantastic punish game against floaties because it's pretty well, difficult. Yeah, yeah, you possible get like, maybe. But yeah, you get like three or four hits maybe. Oh, oh no! No! You hate to see that sort of thing happen. You know, they're so going for the bingo card. Right? Yeah, Randall's like, oh yeah, I'll help you. What, what, what are you doing, dude? Dude, are you gonna do something? I gotta go, guy. Man, <laughs> like peace.